Orange County registered digital. Modern day hosts Edison in a week four matchup and for the love of God, look out. Phew. Edison head coach Dave White and I almost got decapitated. We forward to the second quarter where the rocket man, Matthew Rocket, steals the pigskin. 65 yards, pick six. It's six nothing at the half and the third quarter couldn't have started any worse for both teams. First, Edison fumbles the ball away to Adrian Contreras. The very next play, anything you can do, I can do better. I can turn any ball over to you. Jeremy Maxwell playing thief. More interceptions, you ask? Edison's Marcus Epps steps in front of the pass and houses it. A 60-yard return. Can the Chargers pull off the upset? Nope. Edison tries to crawl back down 14-7, but the ball is coughed up. Here's the Monarchs' Malik McMorris on the play. Well, I got through the line, and I just saw the ball laying there. And uh, Throughout the whole game, you could tell the whole line was getting a little tired, so I just knew if I picked it up, I'd be free to go. So, yeah, just take a chance. Thanks, Eminem. Modern day goes on to win 21-7. We wanted to get better tonight, and I think we got better. Yeah. Uh, you know, if we didn't get better tonight, we would have gotten our butts kicked. So we didn't get our butts kicked, so we got better tonight. I mean, it's part of the game. We got to live with that on offense and on defense. That's what we expect from our defense. So. It was going to be won or lost in the trenches or turnovers, and I think we won the turnover battle. Modern day defensive lineman Malik McMorris scored the longest touchdown of his career. He said the longest one previously was only 20 yards freshman year. When I asked him did he run out of breath as he was marching towards the end zone, he said, nope, adrenaline kept me up. Reporting from Santa Ana, I'm Jonathan Camus for OCVarsity.com. Orange County Register. We are here in the service of Orange County.